Today's painting is going to be a blue planet using only blues and also black and white, but all blues. And it's going to be a planet that's blue. So first thing we're going to do is put on some gloves. You know what they say, no glove, no love. I need the love. I can't live without the love. All we're going to need to do this is some heavyweight poster board, cut to whatever size you want, taped down to a table or a surface, our paint, I have black, white, and all kinds of different blues. You could use different colors, you can use one or two colors. You don't have to do it like this, just get some colors and do it. You also need a bowl, or a plate, or a cup, or something round, or a cap, anything round. If you don't have something round, you just cut out a circle out of paper and you can use that. And some newspaper, or a grocery bag, or a piece of scrap paper, or phone book paper, or junk mail, whatever you got laying around. It ain't that serious. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go from dark to light, from one side to the other, okay? So we're gonna start right here with the darkest blue that I have, which is navy blue. We go navy blue right here, just like that. The next dark, darkest blue is deep blue. Go right inside of that. Next is Brilliant Blue, you guessed it, right in there. And then Oasis Blue, Aqua, so we've got some overspray on it, but it's Aqua. And then finally, White. This is not very safe if you're a child, if you have adult supervision, then you can do this safely with a lighter and clear coat basically like lighting hairspray on fire. You don't want it to burn too long because then the flame could travel down the tube and ignite the inside, right? And we don't want to burn the paper. We want to shoot fire over the painting so that it, the heat evaporates the liquid in the paint. Just a little bit, just increase the heat to evaporate that liquid off, dry it out so it's not so soupy. Now we're going to take black and hit this side, the dark side with black, and then the remainder with white. A little bit of overspray. Then we're going to take our newspaper or our coupons, crumpulate it up, and crumpulate it. We want this texture, the crinkliness. That's going to give us all of our depth. Hold it down with the back of our fingers, just place them down and drag them in like a semicircle, swipe up. Swoop, swoop, and then peel it off. Yeah. Take it with the clean part. We don't want to dab with paint. We want to dab with a clean part because we're removing paint. Dab, 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 dab. Nice. Yeah, yeah. If you get a little piece of uh, newspaper in there, no big deal. Just grab something with a point on it that you can scrape it off with. No big deal. Take some black and just hit the outside edge just to reposition that shadow action. Boom, nice. Now I'm going to throw some fire at it. We'll take our handy dandy sha sha bowl that we don't eat out of. This is not an eating bowl, it's a sha sha bowl. And place it down right here. We want to get a little bit of that shadow underneath the bowl. And we want to make sure that everywhere underneath the bowl has good texture. Boom, right there. Set it and forget it. Now I'm gonna take some black and go around the back side of it. There's gonna be uh, light right here from a light source off in the distance. And there's also gonna be a shine from a star coming from behind the dark side of the moon, or the planet, what have you. So we wanna make this dark around the edge. And then we'll go back with navy blue, right here. Shoop, shoop, shoop. Little you, little you action there. And then we'll just work backwards again. So navy blue, deep blue, shoop and then Brilliant Blue. You see? And then Oasis Blue. And then Aqua. 
All right, now it's getting a little bit soupy here, okay? We don't want it to get too soupy. If it gets too soupy, the colors will drift apart under and over each other. You'll get cell division, and the color that you put on top will no longer be on top. The color underneath on the bottom will be on top, and I just dripped my man sweat on it. Fine. If you mess up a little paint, you can always just, hey, paint covers paint, so that's good news. If you get a little dog hair in it because you got dogs and hair's getting all your paintings, just just take it off, just scrape it off. No big deal. It'll survive. It's just protein, flavors, and such. Okay. Now you see that? See what just happened? If you catch the painting on fire, you will bubble and burn it and boil it, and then the top color will push to the outside and the bottom color will come up to the surface. Just like that. So we don't want to catch it on fire. We want the fire to go above the painting. I was not intending to do that. But just because that happened, it's not the end of the world, right? Because like I said, paint can cover up paint. I know. It's a novel idea. It's crazy, son. <laughs> so we can just go back over it with the navy blue, the deep blue, the brilliant blue. Doesn't have to be perfect. Old Asus blue and a van aqua. See, get a little bit soupy there. Get a little bit soupy. We're just gonna wait. We're just gonna wait. So, through the magic of TV, boom, now it's dry. We're gonna take white now and shoot right here to make the light highlight. Just like that. Nice. And then we can squirt a little bit of white onto our fingertips. Oh God. I think I should call her. Flick it off to the side so the big droplets get off and then boom, flick it on the table. A little bit quicker. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the reveal. You ready? Are we ready? Yeah. So fancy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All you gotta do is follow those exact directions and you will have something that looks pretty much like this. The more you paint this design, the better it will turn out each time because you'll get more used to the amount of paint that you're putting down and you won't get as many puddles. And it'll make for crisper lines and, you know, better color. We use clear gloss to finish it up because it's not all completely glossy. We want it to be glossy like a photograph, a, a photograph, like 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 a, like a po photo, photo. <laughs> Fire on it! This is good. Fun. Little Siny McGee action in here. Now the only thing that you want to do different from what I'm doing here is you want to sign your own name and not my name. Don't you dare sign my name. It's mine's. 2024. That was an accident. No big deal though. Boom, boom, boom. It's like it was made to be there. A little clear coat goes a long way. Shisha. I hope you had fun. It's good to be back. I missed you guys. If you want this painting, if you're interested in it, it will be available on my Etsy along with many other designs that are also very cool.